Good morning children. Welcome back to our computer class. Let's open page number 35 children. Today we are going to discuss few things of lesson number 4 children. Let's talk. When we switch on the computer, Edibuntu starts. The first screen that appears covering the entire screen with two bars. One on the top children. And the other one on the left side is called the desktop. The image, children, this image is the background. It's called the desktop wallpaper. This is the wallpaper. We can change the wallpaper. The small labels, see children, the small labels on the desktop screen are called icons. These icons open specific programs or documents. Now let's understand the components of the desktop in detail. First one children is the menu bar. This top bar is the menu bar. The menu bar is a long horizontal located on the top of the desktop. It includes common functions used in Edibuntu. Indicator area. Children this is the indicator area. In this menu it shows the time and it shows the calendar and the speaker children, speaker volume. See you can, from here you can increase the volume of your sound children. So this is the indicator bar. Then comes launcher. Launcher is a vertical bar on the left side of the desktop. Here you can add common programs which can be opened easily when required. The trash bar, children, this is a trash bar. Like it's like a dustbin, children. Whatever you delete, it comes into the trash. And you can, the launcher also shows the application icons that are currently running, children. These are the things which we are using at present. So you can see over here, children. These are the documents which we are using at present. Then comes the dash. This is the dash. When you click this, it has a search button, children. It is just like in Word. In Windows, you have the star. In this, you have the dash button. When you click on dash icon, a window opens up. Towards the right, the window has a search bar. This is the search bar, children. Can you see this window over here? This is the search bar. The icons are recently used in the application files and download items at the bottom. Children, whatever we use, it can be seen over here. Here we can search. For example, we want to write tux paint. So, ma'am is going to write tux paint. See, we, as soon as ma'am has written T-U-X, tux paint. Icon is come. When we double click, it opens children. So this is how. See, tux paint is open. And now I am going to quit. And this is how we come back to the desktop screen children. Okay children, I hope you all enjoyed today's class. Now I want you to read page number 35. And I have given you 5 questions related to the lesson children. Page number 35. Okay, have a good day. Thank you.